I don't like it, but I guess we should bring the samples back with us. Just be careful with those things. I'd say it's about time we got out of here, Lieutenant. We'll follow your lead. Welcome back, Lieutenant. Congratulations on the success of your mission. Just doing my job, Sergeant. Your success is consistent with your unit's reputation and operational history, all highly impressive. General Garza attempted to contact you a few moments ago. I took the liberty of briefing her on your mission status. Thank you very much. The General requested that you contact her before departing Taurus. The holocom in the next room has been prepared for your use. I'll contact her right away. Congratulations once again, Lieutenant. Greetings, Lieutenant. I understand congratulations are in order. Needles is neutralized, General. You've done very well. Needles was a brilliant man. Taking him down was no small feat. I haven't informed Cardin yet, but I doubt he'll be upset. He and Needles never did see eye to eye. I thought Cardin was close to everyone in Havoc. Yes, but Needles less so than the others. Purely different ideologies, those two. And yet, Tavis never had any problems with Needles. Hmm, perhaps that should have been my first warning. And there's something else, Lieutenant. Tell me, what do you think of Sergeant Dorn? Sergeant Dorn helped me when no one else would, General. Yes, your reception on Terrace wasn't ideal. I'm glad you managed to find the one useful officer in the entire outpost. I looked over her service record. Impressive stuff, I must say. Were you aware that Dorn served with the Imperial military for almost two years, Lieutenant? She told me she grew up in the Empire. Yes, the accent is a dead giveaway. Pure German cause. Sergeant Dorn earned more commendations in her two years of Imperial service than most soldiers earn in ten. Since joining the Republic, she's earned two Medals of Valor. Both for rescuing wounded soldiers under fire in enemy territory. This woman has led an exceptional career. Exceptional women like me and Dorn should stick together. That's just what I had in mind, actually. I want Dorn in Havoc Squad, Lieutenant. Her service record is unmatched, and her assistance to you on Taras was beyond commendable. Sergeant Dorn would make an excellent addition to Havoc Squad. It's settled, then. Congratulations, Lieutenant. You're halfway to a full squad. I'll contact Colonel Gaff to notify him about the transfer. You should go and inform Sergeant Dorn yourself, Lieutenant. Contact me from your ship when you've finished. Garza out. Lieutenant, sir? Is there something else I can do for you? Go pack your gear. You're with me now. A transfer into Havoc Squad? Lieutenant, this... This is the greatest honor of my career. I... I'm speechless. Membership in Havoc Squad is the highest achievement in all of the Republic Armed Forces, Sergeant. Congratulations. Sergeant Dawn, reporting for duty, Lieutenant. I'll prepare my Regulation 6 personnel transfer documents at once. You've more than earned this, Sergeant. I'll gather my personal effects and meet you on board your ship, Lieutenant. Thank you. Lieutenant, I assume Sergeant Dorn took the news well? Sergeant Dorn is honored to be in Havoc Squad. Excellent. We'll have the squad fully restaffed in no time. One other detail. Were you able to retrieve a sample of the weaponized rat ghoul disease that Needles was developing? I'd hate to think of the Republic using it on anyone. Research purposes only, I assure you. Just leave it in the secured case beneath the hollow communicator. I'll see it reaches the right people. That's all for now, Lieutenant. Congratulations once again. Garza out.
Lieutenant, this is General Garza. I see that you've touched down on Nar Shadda. Before we begin your briefing, I want to make something clear. The situation on Nar Shadda is very delicate. This moon belongs to the Hutt Cartel, who take their neutrality very seriously. The Republic cannot afford any incidents. What exactly should I be avoiding here, sir? Imperial personnel operate just as freely on Nar Shadda as we do. You cannot be caught taking action against them. Now, your mission. An experimental Republic war droid has gone rogue, committing a series of seemingly random attacks across Nar Shadda. The droid's designation is M14X, and it is my belief that this droid is acting under orders from Harren Tavis. What makes you say that? The droid is a highly advanced prototype, one that was being developed to serve in Havoc Squad. The project was supposed to have been cancelled, but it would seem Tavis simply shifted the development elsewhere, most likely his allies in the Sith Empire. Why wasn't the project completed in the first place? The droid's design relied on an exotic alien power source, but our technicians couldn't make it work efficiently. This war droid's rampage must be stopped before it's linked with the Republic. An agent of the Strategic Information Service will be assisting you. Officially, you're providing military support to an SIS operation. Do not divulge Tavis's defection or the droid's connection to it. You can count on me, sir. Be careful, Lieutenant. If this war droid is even half as dangerous as its original designers had estimated, you'll have your work cut out for you. Garza out. Ah, there you are. Go ahead, take a seat, and keep your voice down. Jonas Balker, correct? Let's just stick with Jonas. Hope you like the cantina. It's not one of my favorites, but it is conveniently located. There's a vault not far from here. It's a merc operation. Holds valuables for anybody with the credits to pay. Our mutual friend is about to pay them a visit. Do we have a welcome party arranged? Not exactly. No. A group of paramilitary types always shows up on the scene before the droids attacks. We've already spotted them casing the vault. You could head in now, but I don't want to scare them off. We wouldn't want the guest of honor to skip the party, would we? It would be bad if our party was ruined. Definitely bad. I have people with eyes on the vault. Once they spot our target, we'll get the party started. So, Havoc Squad, huh? Pretty nice of Garza to loan us her very best. I'm, uh, excuse me. Jonas! I just wanted to let you know, I made it to Ithor safe and sound. That's great. I'll talk to you later then. That's our cue. The target is in the vault. Are you ready to move out? You coming with me, Jonas? Not my area of expertise. This job is all yours. Take care of the droid, and we'll have you on your way within the hour. Nice and tidy. Good luck. We'll have our eyes on you. <laughs> 